Hello, I am Arsha, occupational therapist of Vaidya Healthcare. Today, I'll be talking about what is occupational therapy and the role of an occupational therapist in a rehabilitative profile. So, as you know, occupational therapist is a part of a multidisciplinary approach where we participate in the rehabilitation of a person, especially when a patient comes under a particular condition or injury. As an occupational therapist, we work under ortho, neuro, pediatrics and mental health. We help people to enable their functional skills and also help them in developing their daily living activities like brushing, bathing, eating, etc. And also help the person to develop their uh, motor skills and cognitive skills parallelly. This also helps the patient to be independent in doing their daily living life roles. So how we make patient independent? We basically help them to adapt, regain or remediate the methods that help them to achieve a particular ability. For example, if we see in a stroke case, the patient might be paralyzed. Either they will be having a disability with uh, lifting their hands or leg. So we help the patient to achieve a particular angle of limitations to help them in feeding. If the patient is able to achieve a movement till this much, we facilitate with activities. With different activities, we facilitate the patient to achieve a particular angle to raise the hand till their mouth. So we develop a proper hand-mouth coordination and also promote a patient's skill to see whether he can eat by holding a proper grasp. In Vaidya, we mostly get patient referrals from neuro and pediatrics, where the patients might be under a stroke condition, uh, spinal cord injury, or either a RT. And even we get ref referrals of patients from cerebral palsy, autism, etc. We rehabilitate the patients with a proper care where we give a proper conditions like doing a proper assessment. We initially see an interactive session with the patient and understand their problems and their point of view where they want to achieve a particular skill or uh, even if we say some people might have a difficulty in dressing. So they will be talking about a need for independent dressing. So we help them achieve a skill of raising their hands and with a proper trunk control or if the patient is not able to come under a particular stanza where we are not able to achieve, we give a remedial method. Maybe we modify the dressing method. We give a, a big button raise where they can uh, hold the or grasp, grab the button in a proper position and put it inside or we give a velcro attachment where the patient can attach the dress properly onto with their own and also help them with different kind of method for achieving their daily living activities like feeding if the patient is not able to hold the spoon with a proper grasp we give a modification to the spoon by getting doing a build up to the spoon so if the patient is not able to hold the spoon with a proper tripod grasp we give a mold to the spoon so the patient can hold it even with a proper grasp like this. Coming to pediatrics, we welcome the children with a warm smile and a good hospitality. And being very playful with, with them, we build a good rapport initially and make the child very comfortable with the current environment. So always we know play as a medium help the children to regain strength. And that is a proper method used in Vaidya also. We play with the children, we interact with the children and also the other support staffs help us to regain a good environment for the child to adapt here. And that help us to gain more interactive and also help in our intervention. Every person want to be independent in their life and they should reach in right hands. And that's what we does in Vaidya help the people to be independent in their life. Thank you.